a lot of places around here have been, sh have been shutting down and it's kind of sad to see, but hopefully this type of, this type of event helps uh, bring back to the community and hopefully get some more recognition around here because it's a really neat area and it's often overlooked for uh, San Diego downtown. This is the first large scale event in Chula Vista since the pandemic. To mark the occasion, the city will recognize more than 3,000 individuals and groups known as Chula Vista champions who were nominated by fellow residents for their efforts during the pandemic, as well as other community, scholastic, and athletic achievements. Rachel Bello and Reina Puente of Las Jefas helped to organize roughly 70 craft and food vendors for the event to accompany the music and dancing. La Fiesta Danzantes will be performing as well as the mariachi, the Chula Vista, so super excited for yeah. that. The music, I mean, I, like I, I grew up dancing here in Chula Vista, and so for me it's the music. It's the music and the people and the colors and uh, that's, and the food, of course, the food. The vibe. <laughs> the vibe, That yeah. Chula Vista vibe. Mm -hmm. There's also going to be a San Diego Padres watch party on a giant screen located on the corner of 3rd Avenue and Davidson Street. Baseball is what Soriano is most excited about. I can't wait to see the Padres game. They're going to have a big screen, right? So I'm excited for that. I'm going to be out with a couple friends, and I'll see if I can get a jersey because I know the line's going to be really hard to get through.